Focus stacking your landscape shots is the best way to ensure absolute sharpness from the very front of the image all the way to the back. And the advantage is that you're shooting at the sweet spot of your lens, which is the aperture setting that provides the sharpest results, but not necessarily the largest depth of field. So by taking a series of shots that are focused at different points within the scene, we can then merge them all together. And when doing it in Affinity Photo, it is incredibly easy. So let's take a look at how it's done. Before we get started, my new book, The Digital Darkroom, The Definitive Guide to Photo Editing in Adobe Photoshop and Affinity Photo is now available. For more information about the book and to order your copy, follow the link in the video description. So the first thing that you need to do is open up Affinity Photo with no images open whatsoever, and then just go to File, New Focus Merge, and that will open the New Focus Merge dialog box, and then simply click on Add, and then locate your folder of images to Focus Stack. It's really important that when you process your RAW files, you sync all of the settings so that everything from exposure, contrast, localized adjustments, anything like that is identical in each of the images. Because if there are any differences between your three or four individual exposures, the blend will not be as successful. So just make sure, as I say, that all settings have been synced when you've processed your RAW files. So once you have your images there, just hit open. So once you found your exposures, click on one, hold down shift and click on the last, whether that's three, four or five, however many you took, and then hit the open button and that will bring them into the new focus merge dialog. And then all that we need to do now is hit OK and then Affinity Photo will go through the process of merging those exposures together. And it's quite interesting watching everything happen because rather than just seeing a blank screen, we're actually seeing the image being processed and brought together as the focus merge is applied. So once it's done, you're presented with the sources dialog box here, but we really don't need that. So we can just close that down. And at this point, we can apply any adjustments to the image that we wish. So that is how to blend focus stacked images using Affinity Photo. Mm -hmm.